Let's try the native MPEG-4 um, uh, codec this time. So I want to show you something about the positional light in Mundle Bulb 3D. And I want to um, change the formula to the amazing box. I want to reset post and position, want to rotate it once in that direction and once in that direction want to go to the 3d navi and want to look for something decent in sight uh, quite deep to see some of the difficulties one can have with the uh, with the positional light because um, yeah, it has to be uh, tuned a bit, but uh, after a while, uh, you you don't want to miss it. So let's go in this area, maybe. Okay, yes, there I want to go. So I press the Z button until I'm close to that. No, I'm even too close. Didn't want to go that close, uh, but I'm um, somewhere else. Never was there from the colors. But the colors won't be the problem in the end. But let's go there for this test. And um, if we're there, let's see. Even, 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 even. Now that's something to be, maybe this is uh, nice enough. Yeah, let's go there. It's not uh, so important. So view to main and calculate 3D. And by the way, I'm trying to do this with the debut video capture software. Um, it's a free software you can get it in the internet and now I do it with the native MPEG-4 codec in AV and I hope it uh, doesn't make the same problems that some other stuff made now I'm calculating with stereo as I see I don't need my voice in stereo but nevertheless uh, ready to render maybe somebody can show me some mathematical stuff I don't understand and it's a cool way fast to do if you if you have the uh, the problems uh, in yeah if you know how to deal with that software and fast to learn so we don't need that anymore we don't need that anymore what we want to do is to uh, make the gray neutral preset and switch down the ambient value completely and switch off the light so have, we have a complete black uh, screen there and from there we want to start to uh, with the positional lights so this is a positional light and it shall be visible it's only visible when it's on afterwards and a midpoint must be set it shall be here and if I switch it on now bush all the way white that shouldn't be the the case so we need some zeros to make it quite darker zero one is still too bright another zero 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 and now it becomes uh, better and now we are there. <clears throat> now we can uh, move it, for example, in the X in some directions. Yeah, we can reset the uh, the point to make some uh, uh, the midpoint to make some uh, changes into the image. We can change, of course, the color to something warmer and even darker to make it uh, and we can move it in the, this is the Z position I rotated it sometimes to make it somewhere or to put it somewhere 
where it's a cool effect. This is X2, sometimes it doesn't function too well as we see. It's both the same direction, Z direction and X direction doesn't change. It, uh, not too much of a difference. What's the Y direction? Well, yes. Yeah, uh, what I wanted to show is clear. Uh, you can uh, set the light at some points and the other stuff uh, remains completely dark. And a second positional light set it in the midpoint somewhere there, for example. I mean, it doesn't have to be that dark. You can uh, put the ambience somewhere. So if you put it now here, uh, uh, it should be on. Then it's way too dark, too bright again. So negative 12 is fine in this case. If we put it in a Z direction, uh, yeah, it's still Z and X. Maybe it's visible for now. So Z, now Z is Z. Z is Z. So if you are at the border of this, you can say mid again and you can move it uh, further in that direction, say good enough for me and you can switch down the highlight a bit or switch down the, uh, the value, negative 13, now it's quite dark, you can now take a third light, personal li positional light at the image maybe to illuminate this thing a bit switch it on no, we didn't uh, have it and then um, move it in the x direction and say negative 13 again and there is way bright shall be blue in this case a bit darker uh, and then you have it like so. X position a bit more, maybe even in the set position. Not too much shall illuminate the left corner, left down corner, downer, upper, downer corner, I don't know. And yes, uh, maybe some uh, global light in the end. This is this one can be darker only with uh, this thing shall be maybe greenish and so you have a complete uh, illuminated scene with some more lights. Uh, yes, it's it's fun. Uh, I like to do it that way to make the lights um, to make the scene uh, uh, unique negative 12 and on and yeah you can also make it dark like so and no oh, it's still over the top okay it's 12 Sh shall be negative 12 and yeah funny light 4 is our global light it's way too bright still shall be darker uh, yes, and this is our scene. Last but not least, we can now we have our five light. We can go to the post process window. We can switch on the uh, five lights and calculate them. It takes some time, even if it if it's bigger to uh, uh, set the right positions of the shadows. Even if we won't need it, then we can switch um, on or off then sometimes it kills some cool effects sometimes it brings some cool effects and yeah that's why what i know from this so now you can say light one hard shadow off on you see what happens even if the light is off there yeah i like the light maybe yeah, more than now if you reposition it it loses the shadow position but uh, who cares sometimes? So, uh, yeah, it can be maybe a bit darker, like so. And yeah, you can play with the specular stuff here and 
bring the ambient down afterwards with the with the other stuff you uh, have to get familiar with all of this uh, some uh, fuck offset far offset no it doesn't bring too much right now but here so yeah the fog and the light together are very nice and last but not least you can in the post process window calculate and this time we try a big uh, uh, get z from image shall be sharp uh, well here and calculate it now uh, three times and if the object is bigger than it's a bigger effect you see for yeah yeah it's something so maybe this is the right thing maybe you can teach me something too if you know uh, much better uh, how to deal with mathematics than I do thank you